we're going to do fall off the bone baby back ribs my recipe so we already pre-mixed a rub and we'll list all the ingredients on the screen that way you'll know what goes in to this rub but we kind of pre-mixed it to save time and join us for the ride uh, the first step you want to do you, you want to flip it on its back this inside here and take off the silver skin and then uh, always base it with mustard and you want to take that and just rub it all over and be generous with the mustard then you want to take your dry rub and just spread it all in here and that's what it is, is a rub. Just take it and rub it over every nook and cranny. Make sure it's all covered. And flip it over and do the other side. And I usually just pour what's left on here. And just rub it all in. Get it all in there. Every corner of it. Make sure it's all in there. Get the excess up there. Put it all in. And make sure it's all nice and covered like this. Now you want to take your foil and wrap it up enough to go on the smoker. But you want to do it and make sure the top's loose. So as it's cooking, all the juices stay in it. And uh, we're going to put these on the smoker for at uh, 250 to 275 for two hours. And then, then we'll turn it. And then when we turn it, first you want to start with bone side down. And let it cook. And then when we turn it, what we're going to do is we're going to add, uh, open it up, turn it over, and then we're going to add barbecue sauce to it and a quarter cup of beer. And then we'll dome it back up and let it cook for two more hours. We're coming to the grill here. What we want to do is just, just sit it on here and then check your time. Two hours, two hours, and then we'll come across and then we'll flip it and do some more stuff to it so after two hours look here they're they're already falling apart we want to baste it take it out cover it up with barbecue sauce and get her all both sides done real good we already did the other side and flipped it over to this side and he pour you in a quarter cup of beer and then wrap it back up and put it in there at 250 for two more hours after your two hours on the second go around you want to take your ribs out and see all the juices it cooked into. That's by putting that uh, quarter cup of beer in there. And it cooks the non juices, and you, you want to sit here and just put it right in the smoker on the grill part. Get everything all good and covered. Then let her go for about another hour at 250. Here's what she looks like when, when they're done. After an hour, you want them to get this dark base, smoke base on them. Close the door. And what we're going to do is add another layer of barbecue sauce. Like so. Make sure they're good. And this is what I'm talking about, fall off the bone ribs. Look at there. Look at there. All off the bone right there and it's still hot fall off the bone ribs 